what's up you guys what's up what's up so this is about to be a real quick video you know what i'm saying i'm not about to take too much of y'all time up so i got this wig i worked with this company like once before and they did change up a little bit you know how people be switching up when you like changing up so bam they changed the packaging so i like the box like it's real cute so i did see another company have the same box because i did review for them but i like the box i got this little hands on it you know what i'm saying it flips open right here and then it just come with some fake lashes inside um so you got some fake lashes inside which are really cheap um you got a wig cap okay you got some fingernail files i don't really know what that's for i mean maybe you want to file down your hairline on this wig i don't know brochure with their wigs in it which look really cute i do like this eva wig 008 she blonde she real cute they might have to send me that hello the wig company is called eva hair wig all right eva hair wig it's this is like a strong sturdy box and they sent me a 14 inch 360 lace frontal bob okay so i'm not like a huge fan of the bobs that's one thing for sure but at least it's a 360 so you know what i'm saying if you want to put it up in a bun hun then you could do that or ponytail or whatever you want to do so inside the cap there are three combs in the front which are one on each side and one in the middle and then there's the adjustable strap in the comb in the back and the nape and i did pre-pluck the hairline and along with that i also did bleach the knots in this and i used the 30 developer with the bw2 um bleach and i also left the purple shampoo sit on the lace where i bleached it after i rinsed the bleach out for three hours so yeah so i'm gonna just go ahead and cut this off camera i did put some curls in it because you know like i tell you guys my head shape is not set up for a bob because i have a long head so you know i'll be trying to make it work for me we always got to make it work for us like i try to make everything work like as best as possible so let me mention, first of all, when I told y'all how I be pre-plucking the hairline and, excuse me, the nape in the back and the sides, I only do that to the wigs that I'm going to wear in a ponytail. So normally, the you know, it'd be all thick in the back, but they actually have it like pre-plucked in the back so it's thinner, which is cool. Like, so you don't have to do like no pre-plucking. It won't look all bulky and thick in the back. So I did want to mention that. So also I wanted to mention that their wigs are not expensive like eva wigs is really cheap like seriously they're really cheap their quality i would say on scale of one to ten i'm gonna give them like a seven and a half to an eight depending on probably the hair texture because like i ain't tried them all out so the two that i have tried then i'm gonna just give them like a seven and a half to an eight you know i got to venture out onto other stuff but mm -hmm, yep let's get into this I tried, I tried to be on time for once, but I still lose my mind. When you are on my phone and I don't have to be alone, oh my, oh my, your kitchen floor is cold. Cause you are in the same room, touch me like DiCaprio. How hard can it be? Just love me like a stone. Trouble seems so far away, but I don't know your name yet. How hard can it be? Just love me like a stone. Cause we are all strangers, I'm just like a stone. How hard can it be? Just love me like a stone. Shower in your bad perfume Oh my, oh my Your dirty hands are cold But you are in the bed now Talking on DiCaprio How hard can it be? Just a mag of stew Trouble seems so far away But I don't know your name yet Just 
dumb cheap okay so i like the way it came out i curled it cute the hairline looked decent and stuff it was easy to tweeze you know what i'm saying the lace but i'm gonna tell y'all this much it is definitely not big head friendly so this is a stock average stock wig and of course it is extremely cheap for the price i think this is probably definitely like the th the second time of, that I've done a wig for them. The first one, I don't remember it being this tight, but as you guys see, I didn't even have to pull any t ear tabs down. I it was kind of like high for me right here. So if you have a lot of hair or a big head, then this is probably not going to work for you. I'm not sure if all of the sizes are like this, but I know that if you have a bigger size head or a lot of hair, this is probably going to be a little bit tight on you. I don't have the straps as tight. I think, let me see, I'm trying to feel. So this one here. Okay, so they're like almost touching each other, the straps, but I know like with other lace wigs that I've done, even if it's a 360, even if they're meeting, there's there's still room for me to like pull down and cut or just not even cut. But you know, I mean like it fits properly. I like the way it fits because it, it's it's good for my size head. And like, I don't be want to do all the customization, but I like the hair density, like girl, please. I thought this was 14 inches. This is definitely not 14 inches. I think it's like 16 or 18 inches i cannot remember but i'll definitely post it below the density i know the density is 150 you know for this to be the second one i do like the quality of the hair the first one that i did was really cheap too it was like this curly one and it came out really nice i think i that was the one that i colored or it might be with your sister company either way you know what i'm saying the hair quality is nice like you know you may want to like check the sizes like look at other reviews and see if other people have stated that it's not big hair friendly but i know for me for a fact that this is definitely not like if you have a lot of hair it's gonna fit loose you know you know what i'm saying you know what i'm saying but you know you could always go ahead and customize it still even if it is a little bit too tight or a little bit too small you know you could work around it especially if the price is cheap it looks very natural and believable and for some reason i just like all my parts to be on that one side and that's just what I like, you know what I'm saying? But yes, you guys, for the most part, you can definitely check out Eva Wig. I will post all of the information below for you guys. And on that note, I got to go. Got to, you know, do some things. I got things to do. And yeah, that's it. So I love you. And I'll see you guys in a soon to come video. Uh, uh,